Hi everyone, I'm John Hardy and I'm the Dermatologist here at Willow's Veterinary Centre and Referral Service. I hope you are all coping as well as possible during this very difficult period. In these unprecedented times, travel is much more difficult and it may be very difficult to get to the vet with many centres only being open for urgent and emergency appointments. Willows is therefore offering a video consultation service which allows us to maintain that face-to-face -face contact with our clients and allows us to provide the care for our patients during these very challenging times. So today, through the medium of video, I'm going to give you my top tips for cleaning your dog's ears with the help of my own dog, Gulliver. So here we are with Gulliver. Now, the first thing to say is many dogs don't need their ears cleaned because the ear actually has quite a, an intricate mechanism to clean it, itself, really. But for some dogs that have underlying health problems such as allergies or in some breeds, for example, like Poodles and Spinonis that may be a bit more prone to wax buildup, then cleaning can be helpful um, for them. So the best way of doing it is to first of all lift up um, the dog's ear flap and then with whichever cleaner you have and whichever um, cleaner your vet has recommended, it's a good idea to give it a good squirt into the ear canal. Keep holding the ear flap the whole time and then you then start to massage. Now one of the most important things is to make sure that you've put enough ear solution down into the ear and you can tell that you've done that because you should be able to hear the ear squelching away when you're doing this. And you really want to massage down the side of the dog's head because a dog's ear canal is much longer than a human's. Many dogs will find this process um, enjoyable. It shouldn't be a painful thing to do, um, except for those patients that have ongoing ear infections. Massaging goes on for about 20 or 30 seconds, and then after you've done that, you let the dog shake its head, which all dogs, once you've put liquid into their ears, will do. And you really don't want to stifle them doing this because the, the process of vigorous head shaking really helps to remove that dissolved wax from the, from the ear. Once the head shaking is finished, it's a good idea just to get a bit of cotton wool or maybe a, a clean, soft cloth and just wipe around the entrance to the ear canal um, and remove any wax that you can see. But you don't need to go putting anything down into the ear canal and certainly not using anything like a cotton bud, which does run the risk of actually pushing material further down into the ear. Once that ear is done, the same is repeated on the other side and the job is all done. 